Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are located. Thank you all so much for joining Amtrak Vacations as we feature part three of our National Park series, Yellowstone, Yosemite, and beyond. Thanks so much again, everybody. First and foremost, let me just take a minute to introduce myself to all of you. My name is Jim Marini, and I will proudly be your host here today. Today's presentation is scheduled to be about 45 minutes to an hour, so I hope you can join me all the way through. I do have some exciting news to share with all of you, and I will be opening it up at the end for any questions that you may have. I also want to encourage all of you, if you have a pen and paper, uh, or if you have a mobile device or your iPhone, feel free to take a picture of our 1-800 number to book any of these exciting trips or certainly contact your local travel agent if you prefer. So again, folks, thanks so much. Today is sure to be a treat. And I wanna mention to all of you, where do you type in any questions that you may have? On the right-hand side of your screen, there's a little area for a question box and feel free to type in any questions that you have as I go through today's presentation. Again, we will save time at the end to answer any questions that you may have. I did wanna mention also that we have a few exciting handouts for each of you to download. One is on the seating and sleeping accommodations. One is on some of the exciting different national parks that we have available, not only to Yellowstone and Yosemite, but also many of the other great national parks such as Glacier National Park, Grand Canyon and beyond. And also the last attachment, the last flyer for you to download is the next picture that I'm going to show each and every one of you. Folks, we have a flash sale going on right here, right now. It is a little after 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Folks, it started at 9 a.m. this morning on Wednesday, uh, today, Wednesday, June 26. And here it is here's the update it only lasts it only lasts until the end of the day until 5 30 p.m this saturday june 29th okay and here it is everyone here is our flash sale special any of you that have ever dreamed of traveling overnight on board the train on any of our exciting packages here with amtrak vacations if you upgrade to a roomette on any package that we have to travel this year or even into 2020, folks. If you upgrade to a roomette, we're gonna take $200 off per couple, otherwise $100 off per person. If you upgrade to a bedroom, again, on any package that you book with Amtrak Vacations or through your local travel agent, if you upgrade to a bedroom, we're gonna take $300 off per person. And all you need to do, everyone, is just pick up that phone, Give us a call. Our agents are here waiting to help each and every one of you or contact your local travel advisor to book any exciting trip. Now, it only qualifies for new reservations and it only qualifies for packages. So what does that mean, everyone? Packages, it has to be three or more components. So what does that mean? It has to include train, hotel, and sightseeing as an example, or it has to include the train, uh, hotel, and a meal. And it has to be either a roomette or a bedroom. And again, you can take advantage of those additional savings and that's to travel anytime this year in 2019, as well as even next year in 2020. So don't miss out on this exciting opportunity. So with that in mind, everybody, where does Amtrak Vacations travel to? You know, I always love showing this map at the beginning of all of my exciting presentations. Believe it or not, Amtrak travels to 46 out of the 48 states within the continental United States. In fact, the only two states the train does not physically go through are the states of South Dakota and Wyoming. And if you look at all those beautiful colored lines uh, right there on the map of the United States, that are that's all the different train routes. Now, interestingly enough, right above the border in our friendly neighbors in Canada, you also have the ability to travel uh, on Via Rail, which is our partner in Canada. As long as you start or end in the United States, on board an Amtrak vacation. Interestingly enough, everyone, you know, last year alone, over 31 million people traveled on board Amtrak. Over 31 million people. In fact, if Amtrak was an airline, it would actually be the fifth largest airline in all of the United States. So definitely lots and lots of folks traveling from all over the world 
here in the United States. Now, what makes Amtrak Vacations different? You know, these are the top six reasons that we've compiled over the last few years from all of our travel partners and all of our travelers worldwide as to why they love traveling with Amtrak Vacation. So I hope some of these are some of the same reasons that you're joining myself and Amtrak Vacations here today. All the way to the left-hand side, it is a bucket list experience, okay? To be able to travel out to some of the beautiful national parks, not have to worry about driving if you prefer not to, or even flying in some cases, okay? To have your hotels, your lodges, your sightseeing, your meals included, we can help you with that as well as your local travel agent. Also, you have the freedom and flexibility. We have daily departures, folks, and in some cases, multiple departures daily. We also encourage all of you, once you're on board the train, to get up, walk around, stretch your legs, go to the observation car, the dining car. Also know that it's hassle-free. In fact, did you know you can arrive at any of the Amtrak stations, folks, as close into departure as only 45 minutes to an hour and be able to head out on your exciting rail vacation of a lifetime. Last time I checked, most airports, you have to arrive at least two to three hours ahead of time, not when you travel with Amtrak vacations. The fourth point is we are the official tour operator of Amtrak, okay? We not only take care of the rail for you, we also take care of everything else from hotels, lodging, sightseeing, meals. We even have car rentals included on some packages, transfers to and from the airport, the ports if you're going on a cruise, the hotels, okay? The fifth point is city to city service. Now I'm doing today's presentation based out of the Boston area and I always love using New York City Penn Station as an example, okay? Folks, there are over 500 Amtrak stations in the United States that you can start and or end your exciting rail vacation of a lifetime. But New York City as an example, did you know Penn Station is right in the heart of New York City? In fact, when you arrive, for those of you that have never uh, been to Penn Station, when you arrive at Penn Station in New York City, folks, you are within blocks, within walking distance of Broadway. You are within blocks or walking distance of Times Square. Well, that applies to many of the train stations throughout the United States. They are located in the heart of the cities, which gives you great uh, flexibility and location to all the major attractions. And the last point is there's something for everyone. I can't tell you how many folks travel with us that are, are traveling with friends, family, their parents, their grandparents, their grandchildren, all right? So if any of you are thinking about traveling, especially to Yellowstone, Yosemite, and beyond with your children or grandchildren, we have you covered. Now, something exciting that I love to share with all of you is all rail vacations can be customized to start right from your local hometown Amtrak station. So for those of you joining myself here today who do not like to fly, who do not like to drive or maybe can't drive, you can do any of these trips that I'm gonna highlight here today or certainly any others that we have, round trip right from your local Amtrak station folks, okay? Very, very flexible. Let me give you a couple examples. So what does customize mean? Well, you could take one of our packages, such as Rails to the Grand Canyon, which is round trip from Los Angeles into the Grand Canyon. And by the way, you can add an extra night inside one of the fantastic, most iconic lodges in the park, such as El Tavar. You can add an extra night. You can also add an extra night in Los Angeles. What does that equal? That equals your customized vacation. Now, the beauty is you can see the country right from the window of the train. And we have a slogan here, why not take the road less traveled? Why not take the track less traveled, rather? So with that in mind, everybody, let me invite you all aboard as we dive into our most popular national parks packages that include Yellowstone, Yosemite, and beyond. Now, when I say beyond, here's an example of that. Here is our Grand National Parks package, everyone that not only includes Yellowstone Yosemite, but it also includes the Grand Canyon. Now let me highlight this package because this will serve as an example to the different packages that I highlight here today. If you look at the map, everyone, and you look at the red lines with the red triangle, that just lets you know that is an overnight on board the train, okay? So as an example, from Chicago to Salt Lake City, that is an overnight on board the train known as, anybody know? The California Zephyr, one of my favorite train rides in all of the United States, okay? Now, pricing that you see, not only on this package, but every package we have in our brochures, on our website, 
pricing is always based in coach seating with the option to upgrade to a roomette or a bedroom. And of course, with the flash sale going on right now, everyone, there isn't a better time to take advantage of upgrading to a sleeper. So if you look at this itinerary, as you can see, again, you have multiple overnights on board the train. You also have multiple national parks included. Now, I did want to mention also, if you look at the map and you see the number one or the number two in a round black circle, that just lets you know how many nights that you're in each of the cities or each of the national parks. Let me take you through this itinerary. Again, as you saw previously, it is round trip from Chicago. So some of you may be wondering, okay, well, how do I get to Chicago? Folks, we can start your trip right from your local Amtrak station or your local travel agent can do that. Your local travel agent could also book flights for you. For those of you who don't mind flying, to fly in and out of Chicago, whether it's O'Hare or Midway airports, okay? From there, it's an overnight journey out to Salt Lake City, which is what you see here, where we include dinner at the Rooftop Restaurant, one of my favorite restaurants in all of Salt Lake City. Now, after we spend an evening in Salt Lake City, that is where the Amtrak station is located. And the following day, you'll be treated on the Salt Lake Express. This is your transportation, folks, from Salt Lake City to West Yellowstone. Typically departs around 9 or 9.30 in the morning and arrives in West Yellowstone later in the day, around 4 to 5 p.m. Now, there is stops made along the way. It's on a motor coach bus. Why? Because there is no train that physically goes up to Yellowstone. But definitely get excited, everyone. The buses have large, comfortable seatings, leg rest, complimentary bottled water. Wi-Fi is also available. As I mentioned, there is going to be stops along the way, including a lunch stop where you can purchase sandwiches, paninis, or even some very popular uh, chicken at a local restaurant. Once you arrive in Yellowstone, again, you'll be treated for uh, a, a tour of the lower loop. And all of our trips are independent trips, which means you have the flexibility to come and go as you choose. But on certain days, such as when we're in Yellowstone, such as when we're in the Grand Canyon, as well as Yosemite, for that particular day, you will be treated for a tour with a local tour guide. And he or she will take you throughout the park and give you the sights and, and, and some of the history of what you're seeing. The Grand Canyon is certainly no different. And in fact, when we visit the Grand Canyon on this package, you also are treated on the train known as the Grand Canyon Railway. Now, that's the train, folks, that will bring you right from Williams, Arizona, into the Grand Canyon. So not only do you get a chance to travel on the California Zephyr, which is the train from Chicago to Salt Lake City out to San Francisco, not only do you get a chance to travel on the Coast Starlight from San Francisco down to Los Angeles, as well as the Southwest Chief from Los Angeles out to Arizona back to Chicago, but you also get to travel on the Grand Canyon Railway. This is that Wild West type of field train. By the way, over 7 million people visited the Grand Canyon last year alone. By the way, speaking of the number seven, it's considered to be one of the, one of the seven wonders of the world. Now, when you arrive in the Grand Canyon, just around lunchtime, that afternoon, you are treated, as you can see on the bottom left-hand corner, for a motor coach freedom tour of the Grand Canyon South Rim, okay? And that will be with a local tour guide who will take you throughout the Grand Canyon. This trip itself, everyone, again, for those of you joining myself that not only want to see Yellowstone and Yosemite in the same package, but would love to see the beautiful Grand Canyon, this trip, 13 days round trip from Chicago or, again, right from your local Amtrak station, which we can build or your local travel agent can build into the package for you, starting as low as $28.99 per person. These prices are based on double occupancy, so $28.99 per person based on two people in a room, okay? As you can see, lots included in this package. Now, we got some other great packages that also include Yellowstone and Yosemite, but are maybe a little shorter, a little uh, less expensive. So again, depending on what your budget is. Here's an example where, unlike the previous package that's round trip from Chicago, this happens to start in the great city of Denver, but ends in the great city of San Francisco. So again, you can fly into Denver if you choose and then do this exciting rail vacation of a lifetime in the middle and then fly home from San Francisco. Or again, we can start you right from your local Amtrak station, bring you up to Denver, you do this trip and then end in San Francisco and bring you home.
Now, this trip's a real treat because not only does it start in the mile high city known as Denver, you also get a chance to go to the beautiful Rocky Mountain National Park where you will have a tour, again, with a local tour guide for that day. And then from there, it's off to Bryce Canyon National Park. Absolutely fantastic. And again, on these days, for these certain days that we visit the parks, you will have anywhere from a half a day to a full day guided tour with a local tour guide, a local park ranger, and that's all included within our packages. Now this trip again, also very popular because again, it starts in the great city of Denver, ends in San Francisco. This also travels out to Bryce Canyon, Zion National Park, Capitol Reef, right? As well as Yellowstone, and Yosemite. And again, just a reminder, any of these trips, everyone can be customized to be as long or as short as you would like. So we find the right trip at the right price. Now here's another example. Here we have Yellowstone to Yosemite. Now this trip, unlike the previous package, which goes to Bryce, Zion, Capitol Reef, this is purely Yellowstone and Yosemite. So for those of you that wanna see both of these national parks in one tour, well, you can do that here. And again, remember, when we go to Yellowstone, you'll head up there on a, on a motor coach bus from Salt Lake City. It's a full day uh, sightseeing transfer up to Yellowstone, where then you spend two nights in this fantastic park, as well as visiting Yosemite. And as you can see, when you look at some of the different pricing, again, pricing that you see, it's all based on coach seating with the option to upgrade to a roomette or a bedroom, um, but it does also include Yosemite as well which is fantastic. And by the way, when you do visit Yosemite, Yosemite, just like Yellowstone, everyone, this is a full day guided tour that's round trip from San Francisco on a motor coach bus. And the reason why being is again, just like Yellowstone, Yosemite, the train does not physically go to Yosemite, but it's so close to where the train does go that we still include it within our packages. So again, when you look at all the pricing that you see on each of the different trips that I'm highlighting here today on our website, in our brochure, those are prices based on double occupancy, okay, per person. They're based in coach seating. So really, the only item not included in these pricing is if you decide you want to upgrade to a roomette or a bedroom, which again, I'm going to highly recommend, especially with the flash sale going on right here, right now, as well as how you get to the starting and back home from the ending city. And again, we or your local travel agent can help you with those arrangements. Now, again, we talked about making sure we find the right trip at the right price. Some of you may be interested in just Yellowstone, and that is fantastic. Look at this package, everyone. Here's a great round trip package from the great city of Denver. All right, just a nice little short getaway trip, five days, okay, with the fantastic price, everyone, with the fantastic price coming in at $8.99 per person, all right? And what's nice about this trip too, is you also get a chance to spend quality time more in a particular national park. So you know yourselves the best. If you wanna see multiple national parks in one package, we have you covered. If you wanna focus on just one national park, we also can help you with that as well, okay? So I wanna keep that in mind. Now, the title of today's presentation is Yellowstone, Yosemite, and beyond. So this is the portion when we feature some of the other exciting national parks above and beyond Yellowstone and Yosemite, starting out with Glacier National Park. Now, unlike Yellowstone and Yosemite, which you can typically go anywhere from the spring, the summer into the fall, Glacier National Park, everyone, for any of you interested in Glacier National Park, this national park has the shortest season. This is only open from the middle of June, everyone, until the middle of September, okay? So it's a very short season. It's only open four months long. Here's a little fun trivia question I have for all of you, okay? Let's have a little fun. In your question box, everyone, on the right-hand side of your screen, in your question box, who here wants to type in what is the name of the train that you travel on this particular package, what is the name of the train that you travel on from Chicago out to Glacier National Park, out to Seattle? Who here wants to type in the answer? Let's have a little fun, everyone. Let's see who is familiar with the name of the train. Oh, here we go. I'm seeing lots of answers coming through. I won't call on anyone, 
but we see, oh my goodness, we have a fantastic crowd here today. By the way, I will mention this is a fantastic audience. We have over 1,000 people that have registered for our webinars that we are doing today. By the way, you all got it correct. The name of the train, everyone, is the Empire Builder, one of the top three most iconic train rides in all of the United States. Now, again, just a reminder, when you see the number one in a red triangle, that just lets you know, everyone, that is an overnight on board the train. And again, I'm going to highly encourage all of you to consider upgrading to a roomette or a bedroom because here is the type of beauty waiting for each and every one of you inside Glacier. I had the pleasure of traveling to Glacier National Park in September of 2017, not too long ago. By the way, there's over 1 million acres within the state of Montana. Absolutely amazing, okay? Huge, huge uh, park, the snow-capped mountains. We do include a big sky circle tour, and this is a lot of fun, everyone. One of the days, you're actually treated for a, a big sky circle tour. It's a full day tour. It picks you up right from the front doorsteps of Glacier Park Lodge. And by the way, I should have mentioned earlier, so many of the hotels and lodges that you get the opportunity to stay in, folks, they are located inside or right nearby the national parks, okay? So it's like the old saying goes, location, location, location. By the way, Glacier Park Lodge is about 209 steps away from the Amtrak station. That's how close it is. Did I mention this trip also includes the great city of Seattle? So again, as you can see, some packages are round trip from one particular cities. Other packages start in one great city and end in another great city. And this is an example of that where it starts in Chicago and ends in Seattle. So again, if you want to fly to the great city of Chicago and then fly home from Seattle and do this exciting trip in the middle, again, you can book your flights or your local travel agent. Or for those of you who do not do not like to fly or don't want to drive, we can start you right from your local Amtrak station, connect you into Chicago where you do this exciting trip out to Glacier, out to Seattle, and then bring you back home uh, from Seattle. Now, again, we have different variations of different national parks packages, okay? anywhere from one to two to three weeks long to even some of our getaway trips, such as our Grand Canyon getaway trip. By the way, the Grand Canyon, you know, it's estimated to be up to uh, 6,000 feet deep, everyone. In fact, some of the rocks at the bottom of the Grand Canyon are estimated to be up to 2 billion years old. You know, as much as there's beauty all over the world, I always say there's so much to see right here within the United States. So here is your chance to do that. And again, on any of our Grand Canyon packages, you are also treated to the Grand Canyon Railway. Now I am gonna give you all a, a suggestion that I highly encourage you to consider. Any of you that wanna go to the Grand Canyon, consider upgrading to the Dome Rail Car or the first class on board the Grand Canyon Railway. That's the car that has the glass dome uh, windows above you. It's fantastic. The scenery, okay? The seats are larger. Snacks and refreshments are also included, okay? So that's an option you can upgrade if you choose. Again, once you get in, you'll have a Grand Canyon Freedom Tour. Six days, five nights. Now, here's what I say whenever I come to some of the Grand Canyon packages, everyone, and I, I'm sure many of you would agree. Folks, sometimes it is more expensive to stay home for a week or two wherever you are located than it is to see one of the seven wonders of the world. Why not travel to the beautiful Grand Canyon, which by the way, the Grand Canyon, as many of you may be aware, operates all year long. So unlike Glacier National Park, unlike Yellowstone or Yosemite, that's a little, little more seasonal, meaning it only operates from the spring, summer, and fall. The Grand Canyon, however, you could travel anytime during the year. And if you're located in an area of the United States, or certainly for those of you in Canada or around the world, where it can get a little bit colder or snowier or rainier during certain times of the year, well, then you may want to consider traveling to the Grand Canyon when it's warmer, right? So again, lots of flexibility here. And I'm going to mention another exciting national parks that's actually brand new for us, Arches in Canyonlands. And again, just like the Grand Canyon, Okay, just like Yellowstone, just like Glacier, we have some great getaway trips available. Okay, so here's an example of that. And again, any trip that I'm highlighting here today, 
on our website, in our brochure, any trip can be customized to be as long or as short as you would like and to start and or end at your local Amtrak station. By the way, did I mention we travel to over 40 major cities within the United States and Canada, as well as some of the small to mid-sized cities as well, all right? So lots of great options, whether it's the beautiful national parks in Yellowstone or Yosemite, or whether it's some of the great iconic cities in the United States and Canada, we have you covered. And I did want to mention as well, you also get to choose between three, four, up to five star, five diamond hotels. So again, depending on what your budget is, we or your local travel agent can help you with those arrangements. So again, we find the right trip at the right price for each and every one of you. By the way, did I mention we have a flash sale going on? <laughs> Folks, I had to put this on again. For those of you that may have joined us a little bit later, we have a flash sale going on right here, right now. It started at 9 a.m. this morning, Eastern Standard Time. And here's the big thing to keep in mind. It only lasts for four days. Today, tomorrow, Friday, and Saturday. It ends for Saturday, June 29th at 5.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. As long as you book with a small deposit, either giving us a call or contacting a, your local travel agent to upgrade to a roomette or a bedroom on any new booking you make. If it's a roomette, we're going to take $200 off the total cost. If it's a bedroom, we're going to take $300 off the total cost. So don't miss out on this opportunity. And by the way, folks, it's not only for you to travel anytime this year, it also qualifies if you book with a small deposit for a trip in 2020. All right, so you have that flexibility. This is a fantastic special that we definitely want to make sure you are aware of. All right, let's take a look at the onboard accommodations. And before I go over the onboard accommodations, I did want to mention when you pack for the train, here's something exciting I love sharing with everyone. Did you know you are actually allowed to bring up to two free carry on bags as well as two free checked pieces of luggage, which can weigh up to 50? pounds each 5050 pounds each everybody all right free of charge by the way last time i checked most airlines there is a charge to bring luggage unless you're part of an elite status with that particular airline with amtrak it doesn't matter if you have guest rewards or this is your first time traveling with us two free carry-on bags per person two free checked pieces of luggage per person, all right? Let's take a look at the onboard accommodations. And the first category I'm gonna start out with everyone is coach accommodations. Take a look at the leg room. You know, I always love showing this picture, everybody, because as we know, when we fly, you might be in a middle seat, just like I've been. Well, the beauty is when you travel on board with Amtrak Vacations, everybody has a great seat. Whether you're in coach, roomette, bedroom, we have handicap accessible rooms. There's two extra large seats on one side and two extra large seats on the other side in all of coach seating, okay? You can bring your own snacks and food on board. There's also a section above the overhead, as you can see here, to store any of your carry-on bags. There's a section in the front and back of each of the coach cars to store your luggage. Very, very relaxing. And by the way, you also have free wireless throughout all the major cities, and you have um, an outlet to, to keep your uh, iPad, your phones, your mobile devices, your laptops all charged and refreshed, okay? Let's take a look now at when you overnight on board the train. And before we do, did I mention you have plenty of freedom to get out of your seat and move around the cabin? You know, I love that picture in the bottom left-hand corner, everyone. Last year, my wife and our three children traveled overnight down to Florida. And one of my favorite, really, experiences on board the train was having some fantastic games of Uno on board the train with my children, all right? Sometimes it just is so special, as I'm sure many of you can agree, to just spend that quality time with your friends, your family on board the train. Not to mention, we met some amazing people on board the train as well from other parts of not only the United States, but around the world. And folks, you can too. Now, for those of you interested in particular, 
to any of the beautiful national parks, okay, where you're going to travel overnight on board the train, we have one of two major categories that I want to highlight. Roomette, what you're looking at right here, right now, everyone, this is our most popular category and our most affordable. All right, let me repeat that. This is our most popular and our most affordable. Now, what's included? Daytime seating that converts into beds, climate controls. You have a small closet, a fold-down table. You also have restroom and shower access. So what does that mean? If you look in the diagram, everyone, in the bottom left-hand corner, as you can see, it's bunk bed style. So during the evening, the two chairs that face each other, the chair that the lady is sitting on right now, folds into the lower bunk bed, and then the top bunk bed folds down. As you can see, there is no toilet and shower inside of a roomette, but remember, it's our most popular and our most affordable. Why? Because right down the hall, just like you'd have at your own homes, there's toilets and showers available, and they're only available to other folks such as yourselves in roomettes or bedrooms, okay? So that is a big highlight. Bed linens are all taken care of. Meals, so whether you're in a roomette or a bedroom, did I mention all your meals are included during the overnight journey from the city you depart from until the city you arrive in when you are booked into either a roomette or a bedroom. And it also includes assistance from your sleeping car attendant. So typically there's one attendant for every sleeping car and he or she helps you with the turndown service, helps you with any questions that you may have. Uh, really fantastic. My family and I loved our attendant. Um, he was just amazing. So let me give you a roomette recap. As you can see, it does fit two people. It's bunk bed style, does fit two people, okay? Um, also includes two comfy seats, okay? Two beds, outlets, fold down table. And again, all meals are included coffee, turn down service, water and bottles uh, as well and linens, okay? Now, you know yourselves the best. If you want your own private toilet and shower inside of your room, no worries, folks, we have you covered, okay? That is a bedroom which does have its own private toilet and shower inside the room. And it also, of course, has room for a small child. So the lower bunk bed is wider. So then your child or a grandchild can stay in the lower bunk bed with an adult. So just a little recap, two adults per bedroom with the option for the third includes all the same roomette amenities, except again, it, you'll have your own in-room toilet, sofa that converts to a bed, an armchair. There's room for two suitcases, as well as your own private sink and vanity. But again, whether you're in a roomette, a bedroom, or a handicap accessible room, all meals are included on board the train. And by the way, if any of you have any special dietary requests, just let us or let your local travel agent know, and we will help you with those arrangements, okay? You can order off the menu, all right? You can order off the menu, especially traveling overnight out to some of the most beautiful national parks. So where can you visit any of these exciting packages or certainly any others? You can certainly go on our website, AmtrakVacations.com to search by destination. We have um, previous webinars that we've done that you can take a look at. We also have a fun little section of trip planning to help answer any questions that you may have. I always say, however, everyone, the best way to book any of these exciting trips, especially right here, right now, more than ever, is pick up that phone, give us or contact your local travel agent, give either of us a call. That's the best and fastest way. Again, especially with the flash sale going on right now, um, only until Saturday of this week, June 29th. And again, that's only if you book, as long as you book with a small deposit to travel anytime this year or next year and you upgrade on a new reservation to either a roomette or a bedroom when booking any exciting packages. Now, I did want to mention some also, uh, also some other exciting news. Any of you that are 65 or older, you can qualify for up to 10% off on the rail portion of a package, okay? On the cost of the rail ticket within a package, okay? Package obviously consisting of hotel, sightseeing, meals. If any of you are traveling with your children or grandchildren, Folks, that's not a typo. They can get up to 50% off, 50% off on the rail portion of a package. And any active duty military 
Uh, first and foremost, thank you for your service. If you and your spouse, okay, uh, or a guest uh, are traveling, you can also qualify for up to 10% off on the rail ticket. So with that in mind, everyone, I did want to mention again, I see we have a lot of questions that have come through, which is great. So I'm going to save some time in just a little bit to answer any questions that you may have. I did want to mention as well, again, everyone, don't forget to download your handouts. Again, there's one on the seating and sleeping accommodation. There's one on the different national parks packages that we have, as well as the exciting flash sale going on right now. So I have to show you all one last time. Again, anytime from today, tomorrow, Friday, and Saturday, it's only going on for four days. As long as you give us a call or contact your local travel agent to book any exciting package, as long as you upgrade to a roomette, we're gonna take $200 off the total cost. If you upgrade to a bedroom, we're gonna take $300 off the total cost. Again, has to be a new reservation and it has to be uh, one of our packages uh, that is already uh, designed or a package that you are more than happy to customize. And again, we or your local travel agent can help you with those arrangements. Now, before I open it up to any questions that you have, everyone, okay, I have a fun question for each and every one of you. So take a minute or so, okay, everyone? On the right-hand side of your screen, in the question box, I'd like each of you to type in, folks, what rail vacation or destination are you interested in right here, right now, whether it's for this year or next year and when? So if you wanna take a minute or so before I open it up to any questions that you have, please feel free on the right-hand side, just type in, what destination are you interested in and when you're looking to travel, okay? Where and when. So take a minute, feel free to type that in in your question box on the right-hand side, everyone, and then I will open it up to any questions. I'm seeing tons of answers. This is fantastic, everyone. And again, we will help you with any of these exciting trips that you're interested in. I see lots, of course, of national parks, Grand Canyon, Yellowstone. Yes, June, July, okay, uh, thank you, fantastic. New York City, great, yes. Glacier National Park, Glacier, July, yes. Folks, keep typing away. We are here for you. We will help you any way we can, all right? So just take a minute before I open it up to any questions that you have. What rail vacation destination are you interested in and when, okay? Fantastic, everyone. All right, perfect. So with that in mind, okay, please feel free to type away. On behalf of myself, I want to say thank you. And on behalf of Amtrak Vacations, thank you for joining us. As promised, we are going to open it up to any questions that you have. And I see a lot of questions have come through, which is fantastic. So as I go through these questions, everyone, if you haven't asked any questions or you have any additional questions, please feel free to type those away and I will do my very best to answer any questions that you may have, okay? So um, we will start. So first off, um, from Jeff. Hi, Jeff. Our um, parts one and two archived, uh, so National Parks one, National Park two webinar series. The answer is yes, absolutely, Jeff. You can find that on our website, AmtrakVacations.com under our blog section, B-L-O-G. Um, we always record all of our consumer webinars which is right here right now our online presentations and by the way today's presentation is being recorded and uh, all of you will receive a copy and it'll also be up on our website okay so thank you very much all right so moving along okay oh thank you mary for the kind words uh let's see um let's see okay just moving along all right oh uh from dave how much are deposits um I want to book today. <laughs> Thank you, Dave. That's good. So deposits, they'll range anywhere from only a hundred dollars up to two, three, four hundred dollars per person, just depending on the size of the tour, depending on the number of days that you are looking to travel. Okay. Um, and again, all that you have to do is just give us a call or contact your local travel agent anytime from today, tomorrow, Friday, or Saturday, especially if you want to take advantage of the flash sale going on right now. Okay, uh, hi Carla, can a bedroom accommodate three adults? So um, a bedroom can only accommodate two adults and one small child, okay? So I will say 
Um, my wife and I, we got two bedrooms when we traveled to Florida, Carla. My, uh, my children are ages 14, uh, 10, and 9. So my 10-year-old uh, stayed with my wife in the lower bunk bed, and my 9-year-old, she stayed with uh, me in the lower bunk bed, and we had bedrooms. So if it's three adults in that case, Carla, we would suggest two roomettes, okay? Great question. Thank you. Um, okay. Uh, from Dennis. Uh, hi, Jim. Great presentation. Thank you, Dennis. Uh, I appreciate it. Um, I have six uh, family and friends that are looking to travel to the Grand Canyon from St. Louis on July 23rd. Is that possible? And can we add extra nights in the Grand Canyon? Fantastic question, Dennis. And the answer is yes. Not only in the Grand Canyon, but any of the national parks, everyone. Again, any trip can be customized, so we can add extra nights if you choose, or we can take out nights. But obviously, in the national parks, as an example, the Grand Canyon, everyone, we use lodges such as El Tavar, Yavapai, Maswick Lodge. In Glacier National Park, we use Glacier Park Lodge. Yellowstone, we use the Canyon Lodge, Yellowstone Park Hotel. Yosemite, the Yosemite View Lodge. So we got lots of great options, okay? So hope that helps. Thank you, Dennis. Uh, let's see, okay. Da -da -da. All right. Uh, hi, Carla. Can you give me an estimate of what the sleeping accommodations cost for Yellowstone and Yosemite from Chicago? Carla, yes. Um, obviously, prices vary on all our different packages. So my advice would either be to give us a quick call at that number listed there in the middle or contact your local travel advisor. Otherwise, one of our staff can also reach out to you uh, to help answer that question for you as it depends on what type of accommodations and when that you're looking to travel, okay? Great question. All right. Ah, thank you, Steve. Appreciate it. Uh, getting a lot of nice comments. So um, where do we find the handouts? Great question, Susan. So handouts are located on the right-hand side of your screen uh, in the section that says handouts. If you click on it, there's three attachments that you can download. Again, one is on the seating and sleeping accommodations. One is on the different national parks packages that we have to Yellowstone, Yosemite and beyond. And the third one is about the flash sale, which is great. Um, okay, hi Linda, if you are traveling in coach, you allowed alcohol in your seat. Um, uh, that's a great, that's a great question, Linda. So um, actually let's answer this. Any of you that are booked in a sleeper, whether it's a roomette, a bedroom, or a handicap accessible room, you are allowed to bring alcohol on board the train. However, it does need to be consumed from the privacy of your own room. So to answer your question, Linda, if anyone is in coach, you are not allowed to bring alcohol in your seat. So let me repeat that. If you are in coach, you are not allowed to bring alcohol in your seat. However, if any of you upgrade to a room at bedroom or handicap accessible room, then yes, you are allowed to bring alcohol on board the train, but it does need to be consumed from the privacy of your own room. And in other words, you cannot bring that to dinner uh, with you. You can order liquor or wine or beverage at dinner time, but obviously, um, any alcoholic beverages is an additional charge. All right. So anyway, hope that helps, Linda. Great question. Uh, let's see. Okay. All right. Oh, thank you, Jennifer. Yes. Okay. Oh, we have a question from Mildred. Hi, Mildred. Um, I am looking to travel as a solo to Glacier National Park. Do many single travelers go with you? Mildred, about 20% of our travelers will travel solo or as single. So Absolutely, and we or your local travel agent are more than happy to help you with any of those arrangements. Okay, Deb, do bedrooms have showers? Uh, yes, uh, the answer is yes. They do have a shower inside bedrooms, but only bedrooms. Remember, roomettes, there's showers and toilets, but they're down the hall. They're private yet shared. So again, the only people have access to the showers if it's not in your room are folks in roomettes or bedrooms. All right, great question, Deb. All right, getting lots of great responses. I see lots of different destinations you're all interested in, from Yellowstone, Yosemite. I see Niagara Falls, New York City, Glacier National Park, Glacier, Grand Canyon. Okay, fantastic. Oh, thank you all. Appreciate the nice, kind words. All right, so just moving through. Let's see. Okay. Uh, okay. Yep. Uh, let's see. Oh, okay. Um, is smoking allowed on board the train? No. So they do make stops along the way where people can get out um, for, you know, 
uh, whether it's a five minute stop or a 10 minute stop or 20 minutes uh, and they'll always make an announcement if anybody does need to as well okay uh, oh, thank you Lita appreciate it uh, let's see uh, from Mary does Amtrak provide towels for people uh, uh, who, who have a roommate uh, great question yes so there is towels um, provided you also have, of course, the flexibility if you want to bring. Um, I know some folks sometimes will bring their own towels, but they are uh, available as well. All right. Let's see. Um, is there space for a suitcase uh, storage in a roomette? Hi, Maxine. Great question. I always suggest for those folks that are in a roomette is to bring a carry-on, an overnight carry-on bag. There's a section to store your luggage right in the same train car. Typically, roomettes, we recommend a, a carry-on bag just for your toiletries and a change of clothes. If you are in a bedroom, you can, uh, it does have room for luggage, but even bedroom, we still suggest to bring maybe a small carry-on bag um, just for that evening if you're overnighting one or two nights, just so you'll have more room uh, inside, okay? But yeah, roomettes would be a small carry-on bag. Uh, let's see, okay. All right, just... Uh, from Deborah, if an emergency arises, can a trip be rescheduled? Absolutely, Deborah. You would just let us or your local travel agent know, and we would help you with those arrangements. Okay. Uh, da -da -da, okay. Let's see here. I'm just moving along. Oh, thank you, Susan. Appreciate it. Sorry. We, again, folks, we have over a thousand people that registered uh, for today's presentation. So I'm just kind of scrolling through as fast as possible. Um, is there travel insurance available from Marcia? Hi, Marcia or Marcia, if I'm saying that correct. Uh, there is, and it's optional, okay? But we do offer uh, travel insurance, which does allow you to cancel for any reason right up until 12 p.m. business day prior. Okay, oh, thank you, Carla. Appreciate the kind words. Okay, let's see. Uh, traveling round trip from San Francisco to Yosemite. Uh, can we still book from Eden? Absolutely. Again, folks, any trip can be customized, okay, that we have. So we have packages already put together, but any of them can be customized. Um, is there refrigeration available for coach travelers? Great question, Larry. Um, there is. Uh, you would just let the attendant know or the staff on board, uh, and they uh, can help you with uh, any refrigeration needs, which would probably be uh, in a section within the kitchen uh, as well, okay? Great question, Larry. Okay, moving along, moving along. All right, let's see. Um, do your share do your shared bathrooms have outlets for curling irons? Hi Mary, uh, they do, but there's also um, there's also uh, outlets in the roomettes in the bedrooms as well as handicap accessible rooms. Okay, so you have that option. Uh, oh, so does the train travel through the beautiful sights during the daylight hours? Yes, Carla, great question. Yeah, mo most of all the train routes, they, they're the times are, are in particular chosen during the most iconic sites, okay? So if you're traveling more through kind of the flatlands, that's gonna be more when you're traveling overnight. But of course, for the snow-capped mountains and some of the iconic scenery, the, the, the times that the trains depart and or arrive are scheduled to revolve around those iconic sites. So yes, absolutely. Great question, Carla. All right, oh, thank you, let's see. All right, folks. Well, you know something? It looks like we're just about done with all the questions. Um, and again, I, I know we did get a couple questions on refrigeration. So if you do need that available, just ask any of our vacation consultants or your travel advisors so we can put in that request for you ahead of time. And then, of course, once you're on board or your friends or family um, on board the train, then the attendant can also help you out with any requests that you may have. So with that in mind, I'm gonna go back one last time because I just, I just think it's so fantastic and I'm glad all of you do as well, all right? And that is our flash sale, folks. The phones are ringing off the hook right here, right now as I am doing today's presentation. I can hear it. Folks, pick up that phone, give us a call or, or contact your local travel agent to book any exciting rail vacation that you are interested in to Yellowstone, Yosemite, Glacier, Grand Canyon, anywhere in the United States. And again, as long as it's a new booking you make with a small deposit, anytime from today, tomorrow, Friday, or Saturday, before the end of the day, this Saturday, June 29th at 5.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, to travel anytime this year 
or in 2020, as long as you upgrade to a roomette, we're going to take off $200 off the total cost. All right. And if you upgrade to a bedroom, we're going to take $300 off the total cost. And again, that's to travel anytime this year in 2019, as well as in 2020. All right. So with that in mind, everybody, I want to sincerely thank each and every one of you again today. Thank you so much for the kind compliments that so many of you uh, shared with me through the question box. Thank you for joining us. And on behalf of myself and Amtrak Vacations, everyone, we look forward to having you, your friends and family on board soon. Thanks so much, everyone. Have a great rest of the day and we'll talk to you soon. Take care.